Howdy y'all, Barry Carpenter here. I'm at the log yard. And in this video, I wanted to introduce the newest addition to my family. I've always wanted a, a bandsaw mill. Just before Christmas of 2021, I was able to get a Woodland Mills a bandsaw mill. I had watched lots of videos and one fella in particular that really was the catalyst to me getting this particular mill is a fella in Canada, a young guy. His name is Sandy and he has a, a YouTube channel called Sawing with Sandy. Very, very helpful. His videos are very, very instructional. Just a great all around guy. He's always got his coffee cup, which he calls his sludge. So Sandy, I have my sludge here. Here's to you, Sandy. I don't mind telling you I'm really proud to have this meal this has been a dream of mine for many many years had no idea that I would actually own my own bandsaw mill this has opened up a new avenue 
if I need a particular size timber, I can cut it. And if I need certain lengths, I can cut it. This mill is set on a, the slab is five by 25, 25 feet long. And the, the cement is seven inches thick with wire grid and, and uh, steel tied in the, in the slab. Now I built a 13 foot track extension so that I can saw up to, at this point, 23 feet, which is not likely that I would ever saw anything that long. I think the longest I've sawed actually was 2110, which having that track extension was really, really helpful. I've got this set on six by eight timbers that are set on uh, two before treated blocks that are anchored to the cement and then the timbers are anchored to the, the blocks and then the, the leveling feet of the track is anchored to the timbers there. So it's worked out really well. I'm really pleased with it. I did get the bigger engine. This is the, the 14 horse color engine and I've never bogged it down so far. And I've got, as, as of this point, I think there's about 60, well, let's see, close to 64 hours, 63.9 hours. And in 63.9 hours, you can saw a lot, a lot, a lot of wood. I've got a bucket here. It's just hanging on some wires that's hooked to the hinge to catch my sawdust. Now there is sawdust that gets over in there, but I can just take a leaf blower and in just a minute have that all cleaned out. So there you have it, my new toy or tool that I'm really, really enjoying. So if you made it this far in the video, I appreciate you watching. Uh, if you would hit like, share and subscribe uh, and hit the little notification bell. Our, for some reason our views have dropped uh, in comparison to the subscribers that we have. I think some people are not getting their notifications and so I encourage you to hit the little notification bell so that you can be notified when we put out a video. Thank you so much and God bless.